Yesterday, I spent probably about 12 hours in the car uh, driving throughout the San Joaquin Valley looking for tricolored blackbirds. Um, and that's a lot of hours to drive some lonely roads, seeing a lot of flat fields um, with the sun beating down hard on, on you. And sometimes it's a little discouraging. Um, <clears throat> but towards the end of my day, uh, I went around to this wetland unit that uh, historically had had tricolored blackbirds there. And lo and behold, I saw massive flocks of birds just streaming in from all, of, all directions uh, into this little beautiful little wetland. Uh, hi, my name is Jeronimo Castaneda and I am a conservation project associate with Audubon, California here in Sacramento. Um, we are in the beginning of the tricolor blackbird nesting season and uh, during this time uh, the tricolored blackbirds separate away from mixed flocks that they overwinter in with red-winged blackbirds and yellow-headed blackbirds um, and as they separate uh, female groups form uh, sometimes into the tens of thousands and they fly around the landscape uh, in the San Joaquin Valley looking for uh, good nesting substrate. Um, so historically, that used to be uh, uh, tulies and bulrush um, and cattails in you know the expansive wetlands that used to be across the the San Joaquin Valley. Um, and then as uh, land use change occurred over the past century, uh, a lot of that nesting substrate native habitat has been lost, uh, and the tricolor blackbirds have found. Uh, a new opportunity, a new place to nest uh, in uh, silage fields where dairymen grow silage um, to feed their cows. And so as you can imagine that's in direct conflict with uh, dairy operations. And so over the years Audubon California has worked really closely with a lot of um, industry folks and other state and federal agencies uh, in a collaborative effort um, to help offset some of the the losses that the farmer incurs from not being able to harvest that silage. Okay. Uh, sometimes friends and family ask me, you know, what's so special about the tricolor blackbird? And uh, that's a really good question. And, and since I started at Audubon, California, I've fallen more and more in love with it. Um, especially, especially when you get an opportunity to see these large flocks and nesting colonies. Uh, there's something really special about, uh, you know, so many birds coming together in one place, um, uh, you know, to build a nest and to lay some eggs and rear their young. And, and just seeing that is really magical. Um, uh, seeing the tens of thousands of birds, um, whether it's in a, a silage field or in a, in a wetland, um, it's, it's pretty special.